So today I want to start with just sharing a few of my tips that I have for looking taller and slimmer. I like to wear flats a lot too and so I really want to highlight how to make yourself look taller by wearing flats. Not all of us want to wear heels all the time if you're anything like me. I do like to wear heels but I do want to try to just wear flats and still look taller. In fact, I'd love to do like a series. If you have ideas for like how you want to learn how to look taller, I'd love to be able to like do more of these videos. So leave them in the comments below. By the way, I am five foot one. Not many people know that. And so when they find it out, I usually get responses like, I can't believe it. Like that's really what I'm going for is I want to play with proportions and like figure out how to look taller. So I've got three outfits today to show you guys where I'm going to start them out like not looking very tall and then like build on that. So the first outfit I have is just a t-shirt and a pair of white pants. My t-shirt's a really lovely color. I like it a lot and it matches my skin tone. So that kind of helps. I like all of these pieces a lot, but it's just like how I wear them. I've also got darker shoes on than my skin tone. And so I'm going to just be like swapping stuff out. First of all, I want to be able to tuck in my shirt. That always is what makes a huge difference in photos especially. And so if I just tuck it in, then what I'm doing is, since I have a longer torso and shorter legs, now it looks like I've got longer legs and a shorter torso. Next, I'm just gonna swap these shoes out real quick with ones that are like my skin tone. And it also helps that this pair of flats has a pointed toe. So anytime that you have a pointed toe, it's going to make you look like you're a couple inches taller than you really are. And next, because the more ankle that's exposed, the better, I'm going to roll up these pants a little bit. By the way, I already got these hemmed, but every little bit counts. And I do like to actually just cuff my jeans a little bit. Usually if I'm wearing heels or something like that, then I don't need to cuff my pants. But you know, since I'm wearing flats right now, I think that it's even more important. So this outfit's looking pretty good already, um, and I just wanna see if I can make it a little bit better. So monochroming is my next tip where I'm wearing the same color top and bottom, and just see if that lengthens me at all. So by doing this, I'm able to make myself look taller by not having like any separation of my top and bottom. So now from shoulder down to ankle, I'm able to have one long line. So that kind of gives a stretchy illusion. And this also works, by the way, if you've got like vertical stripes, like a dress or anything like that, that'll help too. The second outfit I have is actually Elizabeth Suzanne for the top and bottom. I love these pieces and I'm just intentionally wearing them differently than I normally would. So I've got like a really loose billowy top and I've got pants that are sitting on my hips more so than my natural waist, which is my skinniest part. And that's also making my pants look longer. And if you're anything like me, if you're on the shorter side, then most pants come longer on you than naturally. So these pants are not hemmed or anything, but they're supposed to sit a little bit taller on someone than they are on me right now. And I've also, by the way, got darker shoes on, so I'll get to that in a minute. So right away, let's just pull those pants up right where they're supposed to go, which is on my natural waist. Since I'm more like hourglass, pear-shaped, that allows me to have like that accentuated, which is really important for my body style. And I also wanna just kinda roll the sleeves up a little bit, so that allows a little bit more like my, my arms are exposed. Really what that's doing is it's making my shirt look like it fits me or maybe is a little bit small on me, which if you're my size, you'd never run into that problem in real life. <laughs> but that just kind of gives it a, an optical illusion. And then I'm again just gonna swap these shoes out for the pair I was wearing before. And that just allows me to show a little bit more ankle. So the ankle is the smallest part of my leg. And if I expose that, I'm going to make it look like my legs are more slender than they actually are. So the next thing I wanna compare is necklaces. As much as I love my coin necklaces, I think that that would be a really good addition to this outfit, but if I want my torso maybe to look a little bit longer, then I'm going to show like a longer necklace. And I love this necklace by Windblown Jewelry, which is the Horizon necklace, it's super long, and I just like to add like a statement look when I'm wearing this. So now side by side, I think that this outfit now looks a lot taller and it plays with my proportions to make myself look longer and stretchier. <laughs> 
So the third outfit is one I think that we've all worn at some point in our lives. It's just a basic pair of jeans and a basic white tee. So again, I really like these pieces, but I do have some alterations I want to make to them. The first alteration I made was a literal alteration. I went and got these pants hemmed and I asked for the original hem to be reattached. That's super important if you don't want your pants to look cheap after getting them hemmed. A typical hem is just they fold the fabric under, sew it, and they're done. And you lose all that great like stuff at the bottom that makes it look like, oh, these jeans just naturally came this way. <laughs> so again, just by hemming them, I'm showing more ankle. I'm making it look like my pants just fit me naturally a lot smaller than they normally would out of the store. And then of course, I wanna tuck in my shirt right away because that's going to help my proportions even out again. So as much as I love this oversized shirt, I wanna kind of compare it to a similar one that is just like tighter on me. It's just more of a stretchy fit. And so that just allows me to like show more of my figure and that might help me with my proportions and trying to look slimmer. So that's really how I transform an outfit that is like a typical white tee and a pair of jeans into something a lot more like better. Um, I also have a, a similar shoe, it's pointed toe, but it's a little bit darker in its shade than my skin tone. Of course, everybody has their own features and you know this might look different for everybody, but this outfit is looking pretty good so far. I do wanna try the monochrome thing where I'm going to wear the same color head to toe and so I'm actually wearing Zach's shirt <laughs> because I don't have anything navy that's a t-shirt but I do want to see like what the difference is so um so here I'm wearing it like undone like nothing's tucked in and already I can tell that it's just as lengthening by wearing the same color that it is if I'm wearing a white tee when it's tucked in. But just for the sake of making it even better, I'm going to tuck this giant shirt on me <laughs> into these pants and try to make them look even taller. So finally, since this shirt is bigger on me, I'm just gonna roll the sleeves a little bit. And overall, I think this is a really fun look. It's very casual, and I think I do look taller in this outfit. I also like the fact that my coin necklaces have a little bit more of a statement look when it has the contrast of the dark navy behind it. So that's about it for these three out. Bird just hit my window. <laughs> So that's about it for these three outfits. I hope that you really like them and maybe they give you some inspiration if you're trying to look taller, slimmer. Of course, this is different for everybody. You might have like a shorter torso and longer legs. I hear a lot of people who write me and say that. So maybe I would go with like the statement necklace where it's longer in that case. Um, that'll lengthen a torso. And you know, just take your photo every day, whether you post it online or not, will help you a lot in informing decisions that just make you look and feel your best. And don't forget to subscribe because I post three times a week now and I'm really excited to do that. And it helps so much if you guys are following along, just encourages me. So thank you guys for that and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.